guys, this is the LEGO Star Wars Fan 21 here, and today I have an update uh, video to start. So, today is Wednesday, and it's been a while since I made an update video. I've kind of been busy, but yeah. So, I finished the UCS TIE Fighter a while ago, like a week and a half ago. It's awesome, really big, so there's that. That is not going to be reviewed for a while, so sorry about that. And there's no speed build, so. Yeah, that's the TIE Fighter. Um, might be a couple weeks before the review, so yeah, I don't know when it'll be yet. I haven't scheduled it yet, but yeah, there's the TIE Fighter if you were wondering about that. And then, yeah, my room is a mess. I need to start cleaning up. I have a bunch of um, boxes and stuff from my orders in the past week, so yeah. Uh, I have my turbo tank here, let me move it. Um, I'm gonna be selling this. Um, it's, hold on, let me turn it around. It's the Metal Beards Duel. It's the Lego movie set. I bought this like three years ago, I think. Um, I don't know why, I thought it was cool, but uh, it's been in my bin for a long time and I don't really like use it or anything, so might as well sell it for some extra money for something that I will like so yeah I'm gonna sell that hopefully I get like 25 30 dollars for it I mean it's pretty much a new all pieces are there except for like one or two so yeah um let's see what else do I have I have um, I'm going I'm about to review this after I record this video for today so as you can see um, I kind of have it ready still need to put the minifigures up and I have to put things back in it because I kind of modified it a little so I have to put it back to normal and yeah that's that um, I've also been organizing my shelves again and I rearranged everything a long time ago like two weeks ago but I'm running out of room again and because I've been buying a lot of sets I need to find somewhere for that because the Star Destroyer used to be on display right here, but then I replaced it with the UCS TIE Fighter. So, um, yeah, it's big. I need to find a place. Um, my ARC-170 I need to find a place for. And I have a bunch of sets out here as well, so that might be a problem, but I still have some space. I'm gonna go sometime this week or next week to get some more shelves um, for my new Legos, so yeah. Good good news for that and yeah minifigure bin I've been organizing my um, minifigures right here and yeah I've got them all sorted into different bags of the types of characters I guess and yeah I still need to organize um, a bunch of these stormtroopers and imperial for sorter stuff yeah, and then I also have to organize my weapons. Um, I've been on hold with that because all my new sets, I've been getting new things and I want to wait on that so I can put them all in at the same time. So it's like kind of one trip thing. So yeah, right here I have four different boxes and these are um, all the sets I have in my haul video, which is supposed to be uploaded like maybe three days before this video so if you still haven't checked that out for some reason check it out because I've got the Death Star Final Duel Box, Resistance Troop Transport, Post X-Wing, and the First Order TIE Fighter so yeah um, I have these out because uh, I'll tell you right now um, I have all the sets out right here um, because these are on hold to review and I don't want to put them on display yet on my shelves um, because I need to review them so yeah I have each set around and then the minifigures for each set so those are uh, the X-Wings sorry it's kinda dark those are the final duel and that's this so can't wait to finish all the reviews for this so then I can organize all the minifigures put them into my bin over there right there and then I can put these boxes into storage right 
here. So, yeah, it's pretty much what I've been doing. Um, I also have to find a spot for my UCS TIE Fighters box. It's in my corner because I might just keep it out until I review it. I don't know yet, but I still need to organize some of these guys. And then um, I have some more things to do and clean up my room a bit so it's nice and neat. Um, so yeah, I have these boxes from Amazon. They're pretty big, so those can be useful for, um, the boxes can be useful for storing, I guess, these Lego boxes, because um, I have a lot here, but these are the bigger ones, but I can put them in, um, my packaging boxes, because then, instead of, like, having all of them, like, fall over all the time, I can just put them all in one box, and it'll be nice and neat. Um, label like 2012 boxes or something like that I'll think about it what I want to do so yeah that's pretty much it for today um, I'm gonna go swimming in a few hours cause it's a nice day and I need a break from all of this I've been working hard getting everything organized and, you know just yeah been pretty busy um, so yeah pretty much it for today and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace. Today is Saturday and I skipped like two days of days I should have been working but I had to take a break. I've been really busy with all of this so yeah I'm back with another part of my update video. Sorry it's been so long. The last time I talked about what I was doing was Wednesday so yeah it's been a couple days so yeah, I'm glad I'm back. So, let's see what I've been doing. Um, as you can see, I only have two le sets left here. I have Pose X-Wing and then the Special Forces TIE Fighter. Um, and there were two sets here. Uh, I already filmed both of those sets and the reviews of them, so I still have to edit them and then upload them later. So yeah, I'm glad I only have two sets left. Um, so yeah, I just finished filming um, the Resistance Troop transport right here. So yeah, I'm done with this and I'm going to put it on my shelves. And um, I have a lot of minifigures right here from the reviews I just did that I need to um, organize and sort. And I have some accessories, spring loaded missiles and stuff like that so I need to get organizing get to organizing these guys so yeah that might take a while I still need to find a place for these boxes but um, I still need to review this I just realized and these are all done so I can put those boxes into storage so yeah uh, now that I'm done with the resistance group transport I can put this into my storage so yeah um, I thought I'd get to this, but I'm not done organizing this yet. I haven't really started. Um, these were still in some of my sets on my shelf, so I had to pull them out. So, yeah. Um, I got some money. Um, I got some more money for doing work around my house and stuff, so I have $30 here. But this money is probably going for the new video game, the... Force Awakens Deluxe Edition, so I'm really pumped about that. I don't know if I can make gameplay videos because I don't have anything to record it except for my Xbox, so I might record it, but I don't know if there will be audio, so maybe, maybe not. I'm still thinking about it, so yeah. Still need to find a spot for my UCS TIE Fighter. Still sitting in my corner, taking up some space, but... And I have to throw away this bag. I don't know why I still have it. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. I have my two boxes right here that I still have to review. So I have the Pose X-Wing and then the TIE Fighter right there. Um, and this needs to go back on my bed. It's falling off, but yeah. Oh, okay. So... Yeah, that's the boxes. Next, I've been um organizing 
a lot of my boxes. They're all under my bed because there's nowhere else in my room to store them. And this is a good way to use this empty space because it takes up a big part of my room. But yeah, I've been finding a better way to organize it. My boxes used to be stacked up like alone so you can see all of them. But now that I've been ordering a lot of sets, I use these cardboard boxes to store my um, boxes, my Lego Star Wars boxes. So you can see I have this because um, I reviewed that already and then I reviewed this so I already put them in. Um, I don't think the resistance troop transport box is going to fit in this. As you can see, there's like a centimeter left um, of the box. I might put it over the um, line, but I don't know. I'm still thinking about that. So that's a big box. Um, I have some huge boxes right here that I won't put in um, cardboard boxes because too big takes up too much space. But this box has most of my battle packs in it. And then I still need to find a spot or room for my Tidarium box, but... I have another huge box right here, and at the top it's my gunship, and then I have some more um, boxes below. I don't feel like going through right now, so. Yeah, it's a better way of keeping my boxes sorted because um, I don't have to pull all of them out and make a mess and they'll fall over. So yeah, I'm glad I can just do this. It's way easier. So yeah, that's m all of my boxes. That's pretty much all I've been doing. I've been doing less work. I still need to, um, I still need to sell this. Um, I haven't really been looking into it, but I'll sell this sometime um, this month, maybe in a week or so. Um, my friend offered me. $25, but I'm gonna look into that because I might be able to get um, a deal for like 30 but um, I've been organizing my shelves too. Um, made room for the crayons port right there. I still need to put this in here, but Yeah, I cleared a lot of my shelves and Yeah, I cleared two Because I have a lot of sets now, so I have this and this shelf for now to um, store Lego sets. I have the final duel right there. So yeah, I started um, putting stuff up that I already reviewed. So I'm probably gonna put this there. Yeah, it looks good right there. So yeah, eventually I'll have to get real shelves um, outside of my or yeah, uh, so I can store more of the Lego sets I'm gonna buy in the future but I'm good for now this can fit a good amount of sets so yeah um it's pretty much it for, it's for today tomorrow I'll have one last day of an update and then um I'll edit it and upload it to YouTube so yeah uh see you tomorrow Hey guys, it's Sunday and my mic is different because I'm not using my regular mic, so sorry about that, but this is a quick um, last part of my update. I didn't really do much today, but I did get some money, so um, this money that I got, I three $20 bills and two 10s, so that makes $80 right there, or oh, I have three 10s, never mind, um, that makes $90 right there. And um, what I'm going to do with this $90 is buy LEGO Star Wars The Force Awakens Deluxe Edition for Xbox One. So I'm really happy about that. Um, probably going to order it tomorrow or the next uh, couple days sometime uh, when I find time to get a gift card and stuff. So yeah, really stoked about that. I'm going to try playing it. and. I don't know if I can get gameplay videos, so if you were hoping for that, I'm really sorry. I'll try my best to see if I can, but for now, I'm not, so. Yeah, that's all my update video. Uh, thank you for watching, and I hope you found it 
entertaining or whatever. So please like the video if you did like it. And I hope you have a great day. Stay tuned for more.